what's up. I'm, I'm in my other room. Well, I'm watching a film. I'm in my room at my nan's house. I've just made one. It's got a flag up there. It's got some stuff and it's got... It's actually quite a cool room. A nice little room it is. I've got everything. Yeah. That's from Aston Villa. We were, we obviously won 2 now. Come on, you baggies. So... Um, I'm gonna upload this the next time. It might be the next time. I'm just gonna write some players like skill out like from one out of ten, and um, I'm only gonna write a few. Um, so we'll start obviously with Sam Johnston, our keeper. He needs to do a bit better, either way, like overall. So I'll give him a six for that game. Obviously, Abraham he had a chance for Villa. He couldn't score it, could he? So yeah, I'm gonna give Johnston. It was a great save from Johnston, so I'm gonna give him a yeah six, like I just said. Then I think I'll move straight on to Jacob Murphy. Oh my god! Literally, he was so bad. He had two pretty much like it was one on one with the keeper. He missed him. He scared to shoot. So I'm gonna give him a two. He's rubbish, I reckon. Like he can't, he messes up every cross. Like he did against Stoke, he just, he just creates absolutely nothing for us. But we'll probably keep him because he's rubbish. And yeah, so I'm gonna go straight on to Gareth Barry. He's always a good player for us. Just overall, it don't even matter what he does in that match. I'm just, I'm just gonna straight up give him an eight. No, no, no. Giving him a 9 out of 10. Gareth Barry's an insane player, obviously, ex Villa player, but um, he's just a great player overall. He's a boss in that midfield, um, he's great. So, Robson Carnu. In the Villa match, he's quite good, you know. I'm gonna, I think I'm going to give him a 7. Obviously, scoring that. Brilliant header. I don't know where that went in somehow. It looked like he was going over the bar. But, anyway. Yeah, Robson Cornu. And then, Jared Rodriguez. I've already said him. I'm sure. Um, I'm giving him an 8. He's just a good player. Dwight Dale's on the pitch for Jacob Murphy. We'd have won like 5 now. Oh, stop. He needs to stop this, man, Murphy. But, yeah, anyway, who else? Hagazi. Hagazi is a good defender. Obviously, Dawson and him, centre-backs. Um, that's really good players. Um, I'm writing them both from the kid Dawson. Obviously, he played off the line against Millwall and against Rotherham. He scored a few errors, and he's, um, he's a good player. He scores from corners a lot. I'm going to give Dawson a 7. And Hagazi, I'll give a 7 as well. So, that's the end of the video. I don't know what else I'm going to write. Uh, so, so, I know I say it in every video, so we get today. Um, yeah, I don't know what to The time is literally, um, 10 to 12. 5 to 12, I mean. Um... So, this is the end of the video. I might pause it now and then just record again in a bit, but that's it for a, I might see you guys later, something. I might see you guys later.